Real Housewives of Beverly Hills star and movie star Kyle Richards recently announced she was working on a Morgan Wade documentary. So if you don't know much about Morgan, get ready. We don't know yet where we can watch, stream, and react to it because it's still in the works. But I recently asked Kyle if it would be multiple episodes, kind of like a docu-series, and when it would be available. And Kyle confirmed it was still in the works, meaning filming, editing, production, etc. And there's a possibility of multiple parts slash episodes. So basically, kind of like a docu-series. Morgan Wade is such an interesting and talented person. I really am excited about this project. And you know, Kyle has been in this industry since she was just a wee little tot. Kyle has worked in front of the cameras, behind the scenes. So she's got some knowledge into, you know, production, documentaries, directing, acting, producing. Y'all, I'm excited about this project, if you can't tell. And I'm pretty sure Morgan's upcoming procedure will be documented. So let's talk about that. People Magazine exclusively reported Morgan Wade says her upcoming double mastectomy will bring her peace of mind. The country singer opens up in this week's issue, which it was the week of August the 26th, so yeah, you just gonna have to go back and check that out, that issue, that specific issue that is. Morgan spoke with people about her upcoming double mastectomy, which is scheduled in November, so very soon, coming up. And as always, if you don't know who Morgan Wade is, if you've never listened to her music, you need to. And don't worry, I will link all of her social media, her YouTube, all the things in the description below this video. So just click the description and just click the link and go follow her. Go check her out. Go listen to her music. I personally really enjoy her work, her voice. Look, her songs, her music is that type of music that just, it talks to you. It speaks to you, okay? It speaks to your soul. You know, there's just certain types of music and certain artists that have the talent and the gift and the ability to do that, to speak to somebody's soul. To speak to millions of people's soul through their music. That, in my opinion, is exactly what Morgan does. And I admire that and appreciate it. OMG. When I hear her music... Look, I'm gonna hush about that. Y'all just click the link. Okay, click the link below the video. Go check it out. Country singer Morgan Wade was in Stockholm when she got the call from her doctor. The recent test she'd taken which would tell her whether she had a gene mutation that puts her at a higher risk of breast cancer, had come back positive. The news wasn't unexpected for Wade, 28, whose family has a history with cancer. And so the decision was all made for her, all but made for her. She would undergo a preventative double mastectomy. I was like, okay, well, I know what I have to do. She tells people in last week, or the week before, issue that I was given this knowledge and this information. So I'm not just going to sit there. I would rather have that peace of mind. Wade, whose new album, Psychopath, was released on August the 25th, will have her surgery in November. It's the same surgery her mother underwent after also testing positive for the RAD51D gene mutation, which puts carriers at a 20 to 40 percent lifetime risk of breast cancer, according to the Facing Our Risk of Cancer Empowered Advocacy Group. That was a mouthful. Here is Morgan with her mom, Robin. Beautiful, beautiful. 
the Wilder Day singer says, she lost both her grandmother and great aunt to pancreatic cancer and had an aunt who was diagnosed with breast cancer at age 30. After a cousin also tested positive for the gene, Wade's mom encouraged the star to go for the test. I was like, I really don't want to. I complained. I was like, I don't have time. Wade recalls, noting that she feared a difficult process as she hates blood work. As it turned out, all she needed to do was spit into a tube. Now she feels a duty to share her experience with fans in order to draw awareness to just how easy it can be to take your health into your own hands. People don't know, Wade says. They don't. I've met so many people and they're like, my mom had breast cancer. And now they're going to get tested and they're finding out, oh my gosh, I do have it. They just don't know how accessible this stuff is. She continues, I've had so many amazing people reach out that have been through this process and have gotten tested to find out they do have the gene and they're grateful for that knowledge. Through the singer-songwriter, though the singer-songwriter says she's received some criticism for her decision to undergo a preventative mastectomy, she feels confident it's right for her. People are like, well, what if you never got cancer, she says. I was like, well, I won't know because I'm going to do the procedure and then not worry about it. If you have the opportunity to prevent something, prevent it. That's the choice that I want to make. As she prepares for her surgery in the fall, Morgan is currently focused on the release of her latest record, which puts her gritty Americana sound on display. With this record, I put a lot of pressure on myself. It was harder to write just because it's the second one, so a lot of eyes are on this. Was the first one just lucky? Did I get lucky that it turned out great? But the process was the same. I just... Right, I, I can't just write to write. Everything that's on there, I wrote and I put heart into it. I try to be authentic as possible. Y'all, Morgan is a force to be reckoned with. This girl right here has got some talent. Do you hear me right now? I don't know what specific test Morgan did, but I do know you can Google and always do your own research. Please always do your own research. But I did a quick Google for testing for RAD 51D gene mutation. And as look, there's a lot of not only search results that pop up, but there's a lot of different articles and options that you can read through and just become more knowledgeable on this topic. And if it's something that you're interested in doing, then by all means, do whatever you think is right for you and your health. We always need to be health aware, and I am all about this right here. I am. Breast Cancer Awareness Month is coming up, and I've been talking a lot about different ladies that's been going through different struggles and different things that is cancer related, whether it's preventative measures or whether it's treatments. And I think it's very crucial that we all see and hear about these things so we know about them. We know they exist. We know there's testing. We know there's treatments. We know there's different avenues for these different types of things. So I appreciate Kyle. I really do for introducing us to Morgan, whether it be through them crazy headlines that they made. Because if you think about it, look, I'm going to tell you something. Y'all know, if you didn't know, I'm about to tell you, I'm from a very small town in Mississippi. I love me some old rock and roll and some country music. That's just what I grew up on. Morgan has that gritty old country music sound she's a newer artist and i don't really listen to a lot of new new artists because i like the older sound and like the grit and things like that i had never heard of morgan before kyle and these headlines i knew kyle because her movies and i ain't gonna lie i started watching kyle on the housewives like 10 years ago okay 
and I fell in love with her. I just, I like her personality. I like who she is. I don't know. To each their own, okay? But I am very, very, very thankful for Kyle and Morgan. Morgan, I'm thankful that she's open and she's sharing her journey and her struggles because it is helping so many people right now. It really is. And I appreciate that. That is a beautiful thing. I am very, very, very much excited about this documentary or docu-series, whichever it turns out to be. And I will be following the release date very closely. So be sure you are subscribed to my channel. Also, don't forget to click the description below this video and go look up Morgan's music, her work, her social media. Go follow her. She is a very, very talented and beautiful soul. Look, just go look for yourselves, okay? Go listen to her music. She's, she's really good. She's got good talent. She really does. Like and share this video. I really, really, really would appreciate it. I always say sharing is caring. Is that not what we teach our kids? And our grandkids and our nieces and nephews. Is that not what we teach them? Sharing is caring. Well, you can share this video by clicking share below this video. Just share it wherever you want to share it, child. Just share it. And be sure you subscribe. Click the bell beside subscribe. Make sure it's set to all. That way you'll be notified whenever I upload. I love y'all so much for watching. And I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.